the film manager was very cross. You complete silly red engine. What were you thinking? I'm sorry, said James. I was just trying to be part of the movie again. The film manager was furious with James. I want you out of this yard immediately. Read before I tell your controller about this. James was upset, but out. I told you too many times that you won't be part of this film, and this is my last straw. If you messed up one more thing, and then I will be telling your controller. James felt hurtful. I, 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 I'm sorry, he said. And he puffed away sadly. Bokoen and Philip were surprised. Henry switched steam loudly. Uh-oh, said Philip. This is a little good. I think Henry's angry now, said Boko. Henry was angry. Yep, I knew it, said Boko. How could you say that to my only and best friend, said Henry. We, the film manager looked at Henry. He spoiled the film. He only just wanted to be part of the film, said Henry crossly. And you wouldn't let him. The film manager was surprised by Henry's attitude. He, look, look what he did. He just wrecked some trucks and tried to get in some scenes. That's the whole point of it, said Henry. We, now you've really gone too far. Your attitude is making this, this film even worse, said Henry. If you keep this up, up then nobody will, will want to be in your movies. And you know what, said Henry, you've gone too far this time. You just messed with my best friend, said Henry. If you're going to ban my friend, my best friend out of this film, then I will, b and you can ban me as well. I quit. What, said the film manager, you can't quit. You're a part of the script. Who gives a toss about that, said Henry. He re steamed loudly. Now if you excuse me, I'm off to find find my best friend. The filmmaker was in disgrace. Hmm, maybe you two would do well. You can forget about me, said Philip. I'm a great with Henry on this. He went off. Boko, he said. Boko thought. You know what? Henry, Henry's right. Keep this eye to up and we're quitting this film. We can tell all of us not part of your movie. You can also tell the fact controller about this. The film director wasn't shocked. Oh no, he said. It looks like like we have to find some new engines fast. James sat lonely in a in a siding. He was sad and felt very silly. Henry popped up beside him. James, he said. Oh, Hen. I suppose you're here to mock me, aren't ya? Including Bulk and Philip. Look, James, said Henry. This wasn't your fault. Why are you on about? said James. Henry told the director off, said Philip. What? said James. Henry? Wait, what were you thinking? James? Now, I know I can't, I know that was a bit harsh of me. But that director was so rude to you, and you went too far. Henry's right, said Boko. Sure, the factor could be disappointed in you, Henry, but you had the rights to say it. And we were just... He, Henry's your best friend, after all, said Philip. And we were just there because, well, we agreed with Henry with everything he said. They explained what Henry said. James was amazed. Well, thank you, said James. But it's too late to change everything. It's not late to change everything, said Henry. Wait, there's only one way we can do this. This that director will have to apologize to you and make a deal that you could be in the film. No, said James. I can't. Everything I've done to ruin the film has completely like, destroyed the entire sets. It's, look, me, Philip and Boko didn't mind you ruining the sets. We know you wanted to be in the film. <laughs> oh, said Henry, and 
and we and we're gonna bring the factor with us to tell that director off, said Henry. Come on, Jane. Please. I did it for you. You're my best friend. And you're our friend, said Boko. We did it for you, said Philip. James looked at his best friend and two of his diesel friends. Thank you, you three, said James. You're right. I have to face that director. Now come on, said Henry. We, we, let's get the back and shoulder and, and talk some sense in this director. And with that, they steamed away. The four engines still brought back and shoulder to the shunting yard. The director was still furious at what happened, but the factory soon told them off. Your number five red engine has been doing nothing but spoiling my film, said the director. So I want him banned from this yard right now. Oh, oh, I will not let you tolerate with my number five, said the back controller. But you do not have the rights, rights to treat an engine like that. Yes, you may be making a film here. You may not want him to be in this film. That doesn't mean you can ban him from this yard, said the back controller. You're not the controller of this railway. I am. I've given you permission to film your movie here, and all you seem to be doing is just this, this, this being rude to your team and my engines. Ev everyone on the filming set agreed. My four engines had did the right way, especially Henry, for standing up for his best friend said the back controller. Now, you do not have the right to tolerate James like that. And Henry Bogo and Philip did the right thing to quit on your film. So, said the back controller. No, no, no. Any more, any more, more bad behavior from you, Mr. Director, said the back controller. I will not let you film your movie on my railway. The director was surprised. Now he felt silly. You're right, Sir Topham. I am sorry. I I probably have anger issues or something. It's okay to get angry, said the back controller. But if you get angry too much like this, it goes too far. Oh. Oh. I think you have something to say to James, don't you? The director looked at James. I am sorry, James. Your controller and your friends are right. I went too far. Would you like to be part of my film? Jane was surprised. Henry winked, including Boko and Philip. Go on, James, said Henry. It's your chance. Very well, then, said James. That's excellent, said the director. What about Henry, Philip, and Boko? We'll be glad to come back to the film set. Yes, said Philip and Boko together. The director was delighted. Now filming can, can start again. If you agree, of course, atop him. The fat controller laughed. As long as you all work together and act nice to each other during the film set, I'd be happy to have you all. All together. So, everyone was were all happy and soon got back to work on the movie.